Are you grinning? I am. I am. Good day. Happy day. Signed another good recruit today. <laughs> uh, Greg Hart has decided to come back. I had a good visit with uh, um, his mom, and um, he really he he hit hit a lot more things he wanted to accomplish. He uh, really talked a lot about the bowl, his first experience of the bowl. Uh, he has some more personal goals he wants to uh, to achieve, and his mom wants him to graduate. So those are all good things, and and. We're excited that he's coming back. How's his uh, How's his foot? His health? Is he going to have to have surgery? Well, you know, I don't know. I don't know that. I don't know that. They'll get him all checked out when they do all the reevaluations and everything. Uh, but uh, all I know right now, he's coming back to school and excited about it. And he's got. If there is something wrong, he's got time. Yeah, to yeah, yeah, yeah. Do yeah. whatever he's exactly. got. Exactly. Exactly. Plenty of time, and I'm not worried about any of that. But. Uh, uh, this is the first question that all y'all been asking is he coming back and, and I'm, I'm finally got a good answer for you. Were, were there? Go ahead. You got partial snaps from him last year. I mean, I would think less than 100 or... Yeah. Did, from what you saw, I mean, if, if you could get a healthy Greg Hardy mm -hmm. for a whole year, how, what could I he tell be? You what, and here's the thing about Greg, too. I think sometimes uh, there's a little misconception about Greg, but Greg has never been disrespectful, belligerent in any way. Uh, He'd be late for a meeting here or there. But other than that, I mean, his effort and attitude, and going back to your question, if we get 10, 11, 12 games, this guy, uh, he, he's a top 10 guy. He's a top 10 big. And, and uh, what a difference maker he'll be for our, for our team. What were your thoughts at the Cotton Bowl when he was kind of limping around? You say, yeah. gosh, that thing just didn't right. It, it just seems like, uh, for whatever reason, some days it boy it seemed like there's nothing wrong. And the next day it'd be boy it's sore and um, you know it's frustrating. I know it's frustrating for him too as well. So they'll get that good and checked out. But uh, you know you can tell he loves football. He loves to compete. And uh, the biggest thing that I got out of this meeting was how much he enjoyed the success of the season. And that shows he's a team player. And and boy that's what I appreciate.